Hey everyone, I'm Dragon Rider, Queen of Cards, and today I have five Hearthstone cards to show you that have gotten revealed. The first one was revealed through a really fun uh, video that the Hearthstone channel put out. Uh, this theme is this vacation, traveling to this uh, vacation island. So this is uh, on a flight whole bunch of people from the Hearthstone community, big creators, and some members of the Hearthstone team. So super fun. I'll link that below. And the other cards were revealed by Hearthstone top decks. So I'll link that as well. Definitely go support all the creators doing reveals. And let's check these cards out. The first one is Cruise Captain Laura. This is a Druid Legendary with seven mana, four, five stats. It is a pirate and battle cry summon two random locations so this is going to be whether they are locations from this expansion or past expansions but it will summon one on either side of this minion and they will both be summoned and you can use either one or both of those right away and if they are ones from this new set they will have some um way to reopen them so for druid if you manage to get the druid uh location that we've already seen that hiking trail you can reopen it uh and discover more top minions if your hero gets armor so pretty cool synergies there uh the cost seems really expensive but you do get two locations with it at the same time so uh, if there's a way to take advantage of those locations then maybe but uh some locations just aren't going to have synergy with some of the things in the deck and it just seems a little weird so kind of curious to see if there's other support for locations otherwise i'm not sure what uh the best case scenario for this is then next up we have legendaries that were revealed by hearthstone top decks uh first we have carry on grub this is a four mana epic neutral uh five four stats and it's a beast Battle cry, get a one cost suitcase, pack the top two cards of your deck into it. So it will give you this one cost spell carry on suitcase that says get another card and another card. And it'll take those top two cards from your deck. It'll put them into this suitcase, quote unquote suitcase, uh, into this one cost spell. And then you'll be able to uh, play this one cost spell to get both of those cards put into your hand. So just a, another way to like draw some extra cards and put them into the spell so you're getting also a little bit more spells cheap spells also uh this one to me is kind of interesting this one's really interesting to me with the potential of playing it in paladin uh and getting to play the new lanessa out and then have your cost uh, spells that cost two or less cast twice so you could potentially play this it's kind of asking for a lot of cards all at once though but I don't know maybe there's there's some uh potential for it we'll see i feel like i want to take advantage of playing one cost spells or have more of a reason to put cards that are on top of my deck into this so we'll see if something else comes with that then next up we have bumbling bellhop this is a three mana three three undead pirates with taunt and battle cry if you're holding a spell that costs five or more summon a copy of this sure i guess if maybe this is uh used in decks that are a little bit more like control focused or a little bit more long game where they are generally going to be running tools that are higher cost so five you know or more costed spells um maybe if there is some potential for like a shaman that ut utilizes hagatha from the previous expansion trying to run some of those bigger spells and you've drawn some maybe this is another way to just kind of get some benefit from those um or maybe there's something that takes advantage of the undead or pirate synergies with this i'm thinking probably something like rainbow death knight or like a blood death knight could use something like this gets you more corpses you're probably going to be having a little bit more of those higher cost spells and you want the taunts just to be able to like survive a little bit longer so um and they're undead so maybe there's a little bit of synergy there but just gives you more bodies for uh some of those other synergies that death knight already likes to have like corpses and then the last one we have is customs enforcer this is a three mana two five pirates enemy cards that didn't start in their deck cost two more 
Okay, so this is kind of a counter <laughs> to that little carry-on suitcase that we just saw, but mostly I think this is a counter to a lot of that kind of created by, this is um, a little bit kind of a, of a counter to things like the rogue that is kind of getting a lot of spells that come from other classes and then playing those. It's kind of a tech card. It's not necessarily something that I see being played like all the time. It's not something you're just going to slot into every single deck, but is more kind of meta dependent. Maybe this is like a tech card that you might want to put into some sort of tournament lineup if you are kind of targeting specific things. And if something like that rogue is very popular in the meta, this is a tool that people can use to kind of combat that a little bit. Uh, the five health does help it stick around a little bit more. We do have kind of a history in Hearthstone of seeing things that have five health stick around a little bit longer. So I kind of feel like that this might live a little bit longer to try to, uh, you know, stop your opponents from playing those uh, cards. And the big thing though, is that it says cards that didn't start in their deck cost two more. So that could be minions or spells so that also could potentially uh, make like excavated cards cost more as well as there's just all sorts of stuff uh so who knows um could be something that is seen but there's there's some definite potential here uh again this is just kind of one of those more situational kind of techie cards so i feel like in those cases it could be very good but it's not just like an all around general card that you wanna play in everything. That is our video today for these card reveals. We'll have more tomorrow and as the season continues. So thank you so much for checking this out and I'll see you in the next one.